Hey guys, Geek Alchemy here, doing a real quick zoom through. I'm pretty darn happy with my new bookshelf that we recently got from Friends because they moved, so thank you Friends. Really do appreciate it. It's helping me organize. Calm down, baby. Alright, now you'll notice that a couple of my soaps seem a bit short. This is when I thought I was going to do a smaller bar for some reason. I don't know why. But I made them smaller than what I have landed on doing right now, which is why they're cheaper than my standard size. Uh, after they're sold out, actually at the end of this year, I'll be donating them if no one buys them. Or buys the rest of them because I've had one or two sold. But if no one buys these guys, by the end of the year I'll be donating them as, like I said, they are not my going to stay my standard size. Uh, these both here are squirrel. This is going to be the standard size. I do like the design of more of the green. So I'm not exactly sure which way I'll go. So I'm there. It's probably going to be something in between this for my future creation. All right, these little guys right here are the samples I made specifically to go to you guys. This is pineapple. This is coffee. These are the Their Dad Failed Soap Bars. Some are a little chunkier than others, but all are a little bit on the ugly side. Can you focus on that camera? Maybe? Anyway, there is a coupon code available once the store opens for this release. Uh, you get one per customer. You can get one of these for free. Uh, if you like it, come back. You can buy it, and it's only a dollar. It's a nice guest soap size or something you can use just simply for a few uses, maybe a couple weeks, depending on how often you wash. This soap right here, I know it ashed on the top. It looks a little funny. Uh, while it smells good, this is Wizard. I will be looking into fragrant, different fragrance options in my future batches. Uh, if you don't remember, this guy here is Cleric. This is Necromancer and Halloween Magic. By the end of the year, Halloween Magic will be gone. If no one buys them, they'll probably be donated as well. Necromancer is a standard in my D20, so that will always be here. I may or may not make it a cold process soap. These glow-in-the-dark skulls are pretty darn cool, so I have to think about that. This is Mima. Again, this is Paladin. This is the different versions of Pineapple. And as you can see, they definitely discolored since I made the video last. So in the future, instead of trying to color them yellow, I think I'll be going for a green shade. Over here, s'mores. No matter what, everyone's got a marshmallow in here. It's just some people are going to have to wash a bit before they find their marshmallow. But they still smell awesome. They're holding their color pretty well, although in the future they'll be less orange. This is Moose. Remember the fragrance oil kind of seized up on me, so I still have those little samples to hand out. This is coffee. Uh, these are not coffee grounds, FYI. That's just what happens when your fragrance oil gets heated up too quickly in the recipe. So it doesn't affect the soap at all. It just gives it an interesting look. Here we have the oncoming storm. It smells so amazing. And look at those tops. Doesn't that look just like the eye of a hurricane? I love it. This is Krampus. I love these guys. Uh, my winter collection is going to stay available at least into February. By the end of February, I will be saying sayonara. I know. This is my sample section. I will be cleaning it up. Like I said, we just got this 
all set up and I was trying to organize that has yet to <laughs> be officially organized. Here's candy cane. As you can see, the tops of the bars have candy canes or bits of candy canes on them. They all are different with the swirls, same with the snowflakes. Pretty great. I don't know how well it's showing up, but this soap did change a little bit darker as well as Sinterklaas. This fragrance oil also became much darker than I expected. Next time, I may end up putting a vanilla stabilizer in there just because it got way darker than I expected. Again, no big deal, but something to think about in the future. And here's the mechanic soap. I already packaged these guys up. They're ready to go. Remember, there's only two of these flowers. So if you want them, you better get them right away. All right, guys, I'll show you more later on. Have a soapy, fun, geeky day. I'll talk to you all later.